Well, hello, fellow collectors, guys and girls from around the world. It's Commander 35 back here again, and I hope y'all doing well today. Coming at you here with another Star Wars collectibles related news video. Now, while we were going through the chaos of Force Friday, um, we had this um, announcement from Hasbro, freaking awesome one, um, concerning the Black Series, the three and three quarter inch super articulated figures, because we haven't heard like anything on them for months and months and months. Uh, but now, we kind of got uh, some insight into their future, um, the plan of it. And what's going to happen is that this series, the 3 and 3 quarter inch figures, are going to become exclusive to Walmarts. Um, and that is kind of a, a bold jump, um, you know, out of nowhere to just bring it up. But I guess, I think it could work. Um, and along with that, they released um, some images and... and um, descriptions on figures coming out for it already which needless to say i'm super fucking excited for this because i simply cannot take all these five points of articulation figures um it's it's overwhelmingly horrendous to, to you know to deal through that i i just need some super articulated three and three quarter inch figures again i miss them very much so without further ado, let me read this thing right here first. It's like an excerpt from an article. Thanks to Yak Face yet again. Um, and what it says is, This fall, Walmart is the home for Star Wars collectors and the exclusive home of the fan favorite Star Wars The Black Series 3 and 3 quarter inch action figure line. A limited number of the first wave of the new line will be available in Walmart stores and the second wave featuring brand new figures from Star Wars The Force Awakens and a brand new Princess Leia figure will be available for online pre-order. To be quite frank with you guys, I'm not fully um, in the mindset of how this is going to work out actually or is it going to be another disaster like Force Friday was or this, is this actually going to work? This plan by Hasbro to make this deal with Walmart to be exclusive there with the three and three quarter inch figures. Let us just start by taking a look at this first figure here. We have the Princess Leia, um, her episode four self with the medal when they're presenting him to Luke and Chewbacca and Han, obviously. And right off the bat, you notice that the packaging has changed um, <laughs> completely. Now they're going for more of um, a six inch style design of the boxes with a rectangle shape to it. Um, and I'm actually digging that. Now that's gonna be actually kind of uh, pretty freaking cool seeing, uh, just like pick, seeing those in stores, like tons of them pegged up. I don't know, I just feel like that would make entice me more to buy them um, for some reason. And I might actually get that one because I don't even think I have uh, this, a celebration Princess Leia figure with the medals. Um, I know I have the Luke and the Han, but not her. Next up, we got a Return of the Jedi Luke Skywalker in the packaging here, um, looking uh, beautiful. But honestly, I'm gonna pass on it, not because it looks like a bad figure, but because I already have the vintage collection one they did. It's, it looks to be like basically the same exact figure. Might be a few uh, updated stuff to it, I'm not sure. But still, if you missed out on getting that one, this is the perfect one for you. Definitely go for this. So with good news, you always get a little bit of bad, like Darth Vader here on the screen. Um, we don't need it, and also you can see he has swivel elbows. Um, for the Black Series, that is absolutely unacceptable. Come on, Hasbro. Really? Next up, we get another Chewbacca coming. Um, now this one, I'm not entirely positive. Is it, gonna, is it based off the OT, or is this actually from the new trilogy? Um, I haven't really figured that out just yet, but... Either way, this something about the head sculpt doesn't feel right to me. It's like um, his facial expression is very odd in this one. Uh, maybe it's just this particular figure that's uh, in the angle of the, the shot and all that. But um, I already have a Chewbacca. I don't think I need another one. Um, but I mean, for a lot of the collectors who do not have Chewbacca's, I mean, it's fully articulated. He's got his bowcaster there, and uh, he looks um, pretty good besides that facial expression. They also mentioned two figures that aren't pictured here, but they're also going to be a part of the three and three quarter inch line, and that would be Finn and his Jakku outfit, like um, like the f the figure um, that I got from the six the six inch line from uh, Force Friday. It's going to be like just like that, but like a three and three quarter inch version, like just a smaller smaller one, and also a Poe Dameron, the the Resistance pilot. So it seems like they're actually, that's pretty cool that like they're mixing in, you know, the OT with some Force Awakens characters. That's great. And for all you collectors who are unable to find a 6 inch Kylo Ren like myself, you have this to look forward to, a 3 and 3 quarter inch version. Ooh, um, definitely um, sexy looking uh, with this 
obvious mixture of soft goods and that lightsaber just looks great um, the way he's able to hold it with both hands usually figures aren't, can't do that for some reason because I don't know it's just the, the joints don't work well with each other but um yeah this is um, definitely a must-have um, if I if I could get this right now I would um, I'd actually prefer it to the six inch version to be honest with you and finally this is what I've been wanting the most out of everything like I wanted a three and three quarter inch first order stormtrooper and here it is it's coming oh my god i'm so excited for this um clearly he has two accessories so they're doing like the mini pistol blaster and the the new e11 um and just you can tell like oh yes he's got articulation everywhere this guy is packed up and ready to kick ass um definitely gonna army build the shit out of this one. Oh my god i cannot wait it's like seeing this image I, uh, like imagine walking into walmart and there's just like stacks and racks and you see a bunch of stormtroopers just sitting there like waiting calling out for you to buy them like buy me please army build me and me being the psychotic collector that i am i will purchase tons of them i will buy so many that they'll probably not allow me to get that many because they'll have to like limit limit me on what i can get <laughs> I'll be turning to the dark side, becoming a scalper myself. <laughs> but yeah, fellow collectors out there, that's pretty much all this, all I have right now for today. But, but what do you think of this new shit, like from Hasbro? Like they're gonna be doing this exclusive thing with Bla the Black Series at all Walmarts, the three and three quarter inch figures. You know, you got the Kylo Ren coming for it, the First Order Stormtrooper Finn and the Poe character, and also more original trilogy characters and the new rectangle packaging that they're using, like a miniature version of the six inch stuff. It's like, whoa, this is pretty freaking cool. Um, but yeah, let me know. And also, what do you think the price tag is going to be? Because, you know, Walmart seems like they're, I guess, would be the cheapest for prices, right? So are they going to make it, you know, lower than they usually do? Because they, I've seen they've gone for like $13, the other three and three quarter inch six, uh, Black Series stuff. So yeah speculate let me know what you think down below um please give this video a like if you enjoyed you know um share it as well and uh, subscribe for more star wars collectibles related news thank you all so much for watching so me the command 35 until next time keep the peace and love going and may the force be with you Bye bye